If I had to restart and learn AI all over again, there are multiple things I would do differently. I have just crossed the learning curve where I'm understanding everything. I know how it all connects. I know what to do in order to make people money. I know how to teach people how to save days of their entire year. You know, I'm finally getting to that point where I understand it now. And if I had to restart in order to get my results faster, there are a couple things that I would do. Now, these things would have been very helpful to me two years ago when I set off on my journey with my team to learn about AI. But the fact of the matter is, is there wasn't a resource out there telling me what I needed to do. I had to physically go out there myself, grind through all of the noise, eliminate all the distractions, and just study it. So in this video, I just want to talk to you and explain to you the things that I wish I knew years ago in order to get me to where I am today. Now, to be in a position in order to help hundreds of thousands of people with artificial intelligence is just truly a blessing. Never would have thought that it could happen, but here we are, and now I have a big responsibility. So my goal for 2025 and the goal of the team of AI Foundations is to help people. Okay, it's as simple as that. We just want to help people. We don't really care if it takes AI to do it or if it takes just raw help, time, and energy. Okay, we're going to outwork everyone and we are going to help people. That is our goal. And we are most powerful in the digital online space, of course, helping businesses save hours on end, you know, helping people make money, starting their branding, whatever it is, that's where we're most powerful. But we're going to use AI and start looking at AI as a tool in order to help you. AI is not some magic bullet that's going to solve all of your problems with the click of a button. The truth is, just like anything you need to study, it's going to take work, but that's why we are here in order to shorten your learning curve. So in this video, I want to give you a roadmap. Not only that, but I want to give you tips in order to give you a study plan so that you can check those little things off and get to where I'm at today, which can happen a lot quicker than it took me because I've seen it change other people's lives after two to three weeks of even studying what I'm about to tell you. So step number one of this process is to understand that this roadmap is going to be valuable to you. It doesn't really matter how you learn what I'm about to tell you, but you need to take this not with a grain of salt, but with literally everything that you have, if you're serious about AI and you want to use this tool in order to revolutionize your life and the people around you as well. You know, I've seen so many use cases where AI has helped depressed people become hopeful again. I've seen it change people's lives when used properly. And that could be you changing somebody else's life using AI. So this roadmap is going to be super valuable to you. You know, you can't hit a target that you can't see. You definitely can't hit a goal that you haven't set yet. So number one, you need a roadmap and that's why I'm here. I want to give you the clearest path to seeing success with artificial intelligence. And if I had to relearn AI, these are things that I would be implementing as soon as possible because I understand the importance of them. And I've seen it change people's lives when they follow this roadmap. Not just saying that to say that, like, no, people come to me and tell me, Dude, you changed my life. You got me a new job position. You made me this amount of money in an hour. Uh, people come to me every single day thanking me because of how quickly they learned and picked up artificial intelligence from the trainings and teachings we do at AI Foundations. It's not just some gimmicky tool online. It's literally changing lives. So this roadmap is here for you to be a resource in order to get ahead in this space. So step number one, you got your roadmap. Step number two is you need to eliminate all distractions. There's a lot of distractions out there and it's tough because we see the catchy YouTube titles. I've even fallen guilty of this as a YouTube creator, trying to catch the trends in order to get more views and subscribers because it looks cool. But the truth is, usually AI news, if it's important today, it will be important a year from now. And it's cool to catch trends and use all of the new things. But what's more important is actually building a moat around yourself by developing real AI skills that are going to help move the needle in your life, in your business, or in other people's lives around you. And you can't do that by constantly going from one tool to the next, trying to find your magic bullet to success. You need to build up a foundation of actual learning and understanding in order to get ahead in AI. So step number two is eliminating distractions. You need to eliminate distractions. And that doesn't mean quit watching AI tutorials in order to get better or quit watching AI videos in order to fuel your passion. But what that means is don't pay attention to the news. Quit worrying about flashy updates and things that are just going to vanish here in a couple of months. 
the more time you spend thinking about the next cool tool that's going to help you, the more time you're actually falling behind. And I know that because that was me. I was always chasing the next AI tool and it's nearly impossible to get ahead or learn anything of value. So step number two, after you understand that you need your roadmap is to eliminate distractions and really focus on what I'm about to tell you because these things are going to move the needle. And it's a very simple structure that when applied can actually change your life. And I'm saying that again, because people come to me and tell me the way that you teach has changed my life. I've gotten a new job position. I'm making more money now. I'm the head AI guy at my company just because of what you teach. I'm impressing CEOs from top companies. People are coming to me telling me these things. So Step number two, eliminate distractions. Step number three, this is what I would do in order to relearn AI, is I would focus on the four sectors of AI as a whole. Now, in my opinion, there are four sectors of AI. We have large language models, we have AI image generation, we have AI sound, and we have AI video. Now, some of these sectors kind of combine with each other. And for example, in large language models, you can generate images. But the point I'm trying to get after here is we have AI text, AI image, AI sound, AI video. And the reason I want you to learn this is because it's going to help build up your foundation for when we get into the next part of the roadmap. Now you could even throw in things like vision to those four sectors as well. You know, computer vision, how AI can actually read and analyze your images. And you can get some really cool results from that. But I would say if you focus on large language models first, most importantly, and you understand how to prompt you understand how to get structured JSON outputs. You know how to make good custom instructions. You know how to train a model to give you the answers what you want. That is probably the most important of the four sectors is large language models because it's very multifunctional and you're going to use it for many different things in the AI space. You need to know how to talk to a model in order to get good results. Now, once you've learned the four sectors of AI, and once you have a good understanding, I'm not saying you have to go learn AI video 100% in depth if you're like a data analyst and you just want to have some structured outputs with your data. But what I am saying is you need to understand that these things are available and you need to generally understand how they are used because you don't know what the future is going to look like. You don't know when you're going to need AI images or AI video or even AI sound, you know, creating a conversational AI agent that can do customer support for you. There's a lot of things that go into each of these sectors that it's kind of a never ending process, but you need to get to a point where you understand what's out there in those four sectors and you just kind of laser focus in on those because that's what's most important. Now, after you've learned the four sectors, the next step of your roadmap is to start learning automations. Make.com is a wonderful platform. It's a wonderful start, and you're going to be using the four sectors in your automations. Now, there's multiple different resources for learning automations, and I would recommend sticking on the platform make.com just because it's so beautiful. Such a good user interface. That's where all of the blueprints and tutorials are at right now, and learning resources. That's what I teach in my community. So. I want you to understand that automations come after the four sectors. I've seen people, hundreds and hundreds of people try to learn automations and usually they fall short when they don't know how to properly use one of the four sectors of AI in their automation in order to get them a result that they want. And these automations are really the next step because this is the beginning to building out agents. Agents are things that go out and perform tasks for you. Even when you're sleeping, you can have it scheduled, you can have it run on demands, you can have it run when something else happens. Automations have always been around, but now that artificial intelligence is a prevalent thing, automations have become 100 times more powerful. Not only because AI can help you build automations, but because you can use AI in your automations in order to do some insane things. If you could save five minutes a day, five minutes a day equals 35 minutes a week, which equals two hours per month. And two hours per month equals an entire day of your year. You could save an entire day of your year if you take this stuff seriously. Only if you're saving five minutes a day. I've built automations that save me 35, 40 minutes a day. You know, I'm buying back my time with AI because that's what it's truly all about. How much time can you buy back for yourself to start spending with your family, to start working on your passion project, to start writing a book, to start changing the world one step at a time. You're going to need that extra time and AI is a tool, it's a vehicle you can use in order to save time when you understand, for one, the four sectors and for two, the actual automation side of things. The four sectors of AI can save you hours a day even if you were to just learn those. But I'm telling you, once you learn automations, your life is going to change. And I don't use that statement lightly. 
The only reason I'm telling you it could change your life is because people have come to me, as I've been saying in this video, telling me their life has changed, telling me that automations and AI is giving them hope. These are real things that are happening when people understand the actual route to go with artificial intelligence and they implement it properly in their life. You know, you're starting to buy back time. That's huge. Time is the most valuable resource. So you might as well learn how to buy it back so you can do better things with your time. Now, these steps alone can get you super far and way ahead of where you could be if you haven't been following this roadmap yet. But I'm going to tell you this next thing is probably the biggest thing that's happened for me. And that is joining a network. As soon as I joined a network, my knowledge skyrocketed. As soon as I started surrounding myself with other people that were talking about AI, that had project ideas, that had advice for me, you know, I started a community in order to teach other people and the community in a way almost taught me. I learned more in six months of having in a community than I did in two years of learning AI on my own. So networking with people, like-minded individuals in a community that's dedicated to AI is going to dramatically increase the rate at which you learn. Because not only are you being held accountable by your network, but you're also being surrounded with all of the positive talk and all of the things that actually matter. And you almost have a built-in support system with a community, which is just amazing. So surrounding yourself with a network, you know, with hundreds of people that are focused on the same thing, leveraging AI for their industry, especially when they come from different industries, think about how powerful that is. In a single community, when you have lawyers trying to leverage AI, you have content marketers trying to leverage AI, you have real estate agents, you have doctors, you have all of these people in one network focused on AI, you need to join a network and a community. This will take you to the next level, maybe more than anything. So if you really wanna take this seriously, you wanna get focused in, you wanna eliminate all those distractions, learn the four sectors of AI, start learning automations, get access to an amazing network, then our community is the spot you have to be. And the only reason I'm doing this and giving you this tool is because I would be doing you a disservice by not letting you know this is available because I've seen this community right here, the AI Foundations community, change people's lives, give them a new sense of hope, land them new job positions, make them $300 an hour. People are selling services for $300 an hour in here because of what they learned. You know, people are starting new businesses. I think we've had like seven or eight new businesses start from the knowledge that people have learned in the AI Foundations community. So I'm going to leave a link in the description and top end comment to join us and to master this roadmap for you. I just want to help you. I want to help you get to where you want to be. I want you to save hours and days out of your year in order to go spend it with family, in order to read more books, in order to think about your sleep, in order to work on your personal health, your spiritual life, whatever it may be. My job is to save you time, okay? And my job is to help shorten the learning curve for you when it comes to learning all of this stuff with artificial intelligence that actually matters. So eliminate distractions, Block out all that noise, learn the four sectors, learn automations, jump in a network. And we have it all here in your secret tool, AI Foundation. So this is unlike my usual style of YouTube video, I know, but I felt it was important to make and a lot more YouTube videos like this are going to be coming from me. So if you enjoy this type of content, please like and subscribe. I really appreciate it. Please let me know if I can help you in any way in the comments below. If you want to join the community, again, I'll leave it below genuinely think it's your secret tool to success. I'm not giving you anything that I know doesn't already work. The best students in the community, if you want to be an absolute killer with AI, then you have to become the best student first. The best students within the community have seen the most success, made the most money, gotten new promotions and so on. So I hope to see you in there and I hope you enjoyed this. If you don't want to join, I already know that this roadmap is going to help fast track your rate of success. So with that being said, I'll either see you in the community or I'll see you in the next video.